You just received your FX CAD serial number, saw an activation limit exceeded error, or just have general questions about how FX CAD licensing works. Today, we will dive into all the details of FX CAD licensing. You will receive your serial number from our activations team within three business days of your FX CAD purchase. Excited to start and don't want to wait? No worries. We offer a free 30-day trial that only requires you to have an Autodesk account. Once you have your serial number, make sure you have your appropriate version of FX CAD installed. When you open FX CAD, you'll see an Autodesk privacy statement. If you choose to agree, you'll then see the product license activation screen. To begin the activation process, select Activate, then enter your serial number and product key. Select Next, and that's it! Woohoo! You just activated and now are ready to start designing an FX CAD. Are you receiving an activation limit exceeded error? Do you have an older version of FX CAD and have a new computer? Had a change in staff or simply need to activate a second machine for yourself? Please reach out to our technical support team with a brief description of the situation and we will be happy to help and add an additional seat to your serial number at no additional charge. Please note that Autodesk allows clients to have up to two machines belonging to the same user registered to the same serial number. These machines may not be used at the same time. Now let's get into some friendly reminders, license manager etiquette, helpful tips, and Autodesk policies that FX CAD users are required to abide by. Autodesk does not allow the sharing of FX CAD serial numbers amongst different users. In other words, the number of FX CAD users your office has is the number of FX CAD licenses your office would need. As mentioned earlier, Autodesk permits users to install and activate with the same serial number on up to two computers, a desktop and a laptop, for example. Please note that the Windows username is required to accurately reflect the user of the machine. Need to clean up, have a change in users, or need to make general changes to your license manager? Please reach out to our technical support team and we will be happy to help. Autodesk requires the license manager to reflect each FXCAD user and their machine, so we always recommend keeping a spreadsheet or list of your FXCAD users, their machine names, and assigned serial numbers outside of the license manager to ensure accuracy, as the license manager is not automated and is updated by our activations team as needed. We've just thrown a lot of information at you, so don't forget that our team is always happy to help clarify any questions or policies. Thank you for watching!